Hey, it's me, Pro Jared. Welcome back to Arrow Biz, where we last left off. We made some cash money. As you can see there, expenses are slightly less, slightly less than sales, which means profit. Uh, we're gonna tweak some things though. Now, it looks like our uh, all or our services are almost up there. The green bar is where we're currently at. The little white arrow is what we're projected to get to. And that yellow arrow is the average of everyone else. So we're still below, still below everyone else. But we are gonna check on our on our three routes. Don't, don't, don't close any. Don't close any. We're gonna check out our three routes to see what's uh, making money, what isn't. Let's see. Vancouver to Honolulu. Doing better. Good. New York, awesome. Vancouver to Tokyo. Cash money. Good. So all those those are all good. We don't need to touch those. They will. Even it's not much, they'll make money for us. We just gotta lower our expenses and stop spending so much every time. All right, I'm gonna spend some money uh, opening from Vancouver and going to Mexico. No one has that yet. We can't afford it. Oh. Do I have extra planes I can sell? Uh, I have one spare 707 and one spare DC-8. That's not great. Okay. Okay, here we go. So what we'll do is uh, we can go to certain cities and... So I, th I think... I think the way some of this works... Is that... Um, if you have slots with cities, like that is... That it costs money every, every quarter? I actually... This is why I like everything getting complete in the box. So we can take a look at the uh, manual. And I wonder if there's just like a general how to not, how to make money. How to not, how to not be bad. Cities around the world, page 42. Look at this, it's, it's just the actual cities. That's, I don't, didn't need a geography lesson. I just want to know how to make the money. What? Alright. Well, I'm going to assume this is the case. So, I'm going to return some LA slots. Not all of them, but just some. Because I wonder if doing that will just, uh... Save, save me some money every month. Oops. I try to get... I can, if I, once I can afford it, I can fly to Beijing. I know that ship has sailed in terms of, uh, the, the Olympics. I return those, return that. I'll, I've got one extra one in New York that I really don't need. I'll return that as well. And maybe that'll help my expenses. You know, let's just do some science here. See what happens. I'll continue to look at the, the dang book. See if that'll tell me. Man, this manual is thick. It's got like 40 some pages. Alright, competition wide, we're still neck and neck. <gasps> Look! I'm up there! <laughs> Overall this year, I only lost $12,000. I did better than Natal Air! What about the quarter report? <gasps> Pink! Yes! Did it actually work? Do returning those slots is what make me money? Or not spend so much money? Everyone else's bars are so big. Uh, it's only a matter of time before they start competing me elsewhere and I'm just gonna get wrecked. Oh, here we go. Negotiations for slots. Send your managers out to negotiate with worldwide airports for holding slots. Blah. Wait, what does that say? Oh, yep, there it is. Once you're awarded slots, you must pay to keep them open even when not in use. I am an idiot. I've been playing this game for over 20 years. And I don't think I ever realized that. <laughs> well, knowing that, uh, I'm gonna return some more slots here that I just, that just, I don't, I don't feel like I really need right now. Have, have them all back, Hawaii. You're, you're expensive, I don't need them. Los Angeles. No one wants to fly to you. 
Just go ahead and have those back. If I, if I start making fat coin, I'll come back for it. I still don't think I can open any more. I can't even open anymore though, can I? How much does it cost? 90,000? I've got 32. Oh, only 60,000 to Beijing. Okay, so it's a bit cheaper. Wait, 60,000 to Beijing, but 90 to Mexico? What the shit, Mexico? I wanna... I wanna keep some slots open at, uh... At, at, at my... my... At Vancouver, because I need to fly from there, because that's my only branch at the moment. Alright, those are pretty long flights, and there's no way a single plane can, uh... Get several flights a week, so I should probably return a couple of those slots. So usually when I play this game, like the first thing I do is I just go out and I just get as many slots as possible. Just because I gotta gotta get them all before they they're all up. Because there there is a limited amount at each city, and all your competitors always show up to take them. So I, I think I've never done that before. I feel so stupid. I might. I might reset and try again. <gasps> I'M BEATING YOU! Yes! Yes! Money! <laughs> yeah! Mm. Remember when we made fun of Late Air and they had like the most cash money out of anyone? Look, I am the CEO. I call the shots. Okay? That's just how it is. Eventually, to beat the game, you have to like, connect the whole world under your network. All 22 cities have to be there. Alright, do I need to, to have more... Uh, you must make more of an effort. I'm trying, lady! I looked at the instruction manual. Look, as long as our current flights are making us money, slow and steady wins the race. Although there is a time limit. But right now we're doing okay. Yeah, all, all, all this looks good to me. I don't think I'd really tweak anything here. I mean, otherwise, like, sales-wise? Vancouver, Tokyo, $65,000. There's, uh, 6 point... 65 million? Jesus, okay. Uh, the other ones, 18 and 13. So, like, they are making a profit, not much. But I, I just need anything to get right now, so I, I need to do a lot more long-distance flights. I wish there was a better way to know the distance between cities. Like, can I go to Vancouver down to, like, I don't know, Lima? Also, shout out to this game for helping me learn where several cities are over the world. Okay, that's real. Who says games can't be educational? I learned a lot from this game. Learn that making fat stacks of cash is most important. What's happening? Oh no! Oh, Singapore withdrew from the Federation of Malaysia in August of this year. This marks the birth of a small, independent country. We must capitalize on that for profit! Oh, that's the most corporate thing I've ever said in my entire life. Oh, I'm sorry. Yo, I'm making more money, $30,000 a year now. It's coming up. See, I'm getting there. I technically made more money than Air West. Probably because they spent a lot of money so they could make more money. But that year, I beat them. See, now I have enough money to open up to Beijing. Sales increasing. Keep it up, she says. Great. All right, and my uh, my services are finally maxing out my uh, service budgeting, repair, etc. Okay. 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 Beijing. Super, super popular city. Here we go. That plane does not have. Nope. I don't have a plane that reaches it. I'm an idiot. The distance was fifty-two fifty. What, fly, what place do I have right now? I have 50, 60. 200 miles short. Which means I don't need those slots at all, and I've been paying money for nothing! Lady! Destroy it! For I am dumb. 
really good at video games, you guys. Especially when it comes to to ones with numbers. Board meeting! Board meeting, come here. Come here. Alright, what do you guys think? Where should we uh where should we open a route? How about opening a route from Vancouver to Los Angeles? Psh, throw them out the window. Alright, what about, what about everyone else? What about our roots? What do you think about our roots? Which roots would you request? Alright, let's look at. Now we're killing we're killing the New York one, but this the Vancouver to Honolulu. I feel like we should be making more money there, and we're not. What do you guys think? We should change to smaller planes on this route. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Get out. Alright, anyone else? Uh, what about the, uh... Tokyo one's making a lot of money, though, right? What do you guys think about that one? We should change to smaller planes on this route. Who let him in here? Okay, what, what about the market? We need to keep our name in the spotlight. Thank you. That's very helpful. What do you guys think about planes? How about purchasing more B-707s? We also need some DC-8s. Just buy more planes! Thank, thank you. Alright, meeting's adjourned. I'll see you next quarter. Idiots! I work with idiots! <laughs> I'm still having a good time. Mm. Once, once smaller planes are available, though. Yep, cash money coming in. Gotten profit. Okay. I should have enough now to go from Vancouver to Mexico. Look at that. I'm up to second in profits. We're in good shape, she says. Okay. Let's uh, make some money. Vancouver to Mexico. Easy route, easy route. Uh, it's a short route. Uh, let's go with the DC-8s, just because he's got a lot of seats on there. Pump that bitch full of flights. Mm, maximize that money, because no one can argue with me. That's right. It costs $1,300 to go from Mexico to Vancouver. One way! Give me all your cash. That might make me money. Let's find out. Or it could be awful. It could just be awful. I am awful. This is one of those games I always wanted to do a pro Jared video on. But it's just, you know, how do you make it interesting? I mean, I think it's fascinating myself. I love this shit. But how would you make it interesting to watch for a general YouTube audience? Who knows? Look, pro air's up there. Another Italian air, bitch. I have slightly less profit just because I had to spend money to open up the new route. Oh my god, they already have half the world connected. Jesus. I think it's a little bit easier to get more cities if you start off somewhere in like Europe or Asia just because there's so many smaller main cities there. I already started in the US though. Because I don't know. Alright, we just opened up a new route. How's it looking? Uh, Fine. It looks fine. There's not enough people on it, though, so we can... Reduce the number of flights per week. That might help the, uh, the old expenses there. Yeah, like that Vancouver to New York one? It's, it's a lot of comedy happening. I could, I could, I could. How are they making more money than me? Yeah, see, they literally have double the amount of flights per week. And that's, that's like just doubling their profits. Even though, interestingly, we have like similar amount of actual passengers. No, I think if I'm reading that right. No, because they're like, like getting twice as many. I guess, I guess, uh, I, I have half the amount of flights that they do, so they're... I'm hurting my head as I'm trying to think about it. I don't have any more slots. I could try to get more slots. Try to make that one more profitable. Hmm, maybe. Maybe. 
gonna return some more slots here. Whoops. I don't want to talk to you. Alright. I got a couple going to Mexico. And that's all we really need. Uh, let's just open up. Man, they really wanted me to do Los Angeles. Don't know why. Because it's super busy and it'd be very valuable. That's why. Alright, fine. We'll do Los Angeles. Only a little bit. Just we have something there. Six months? Not good enough. Lady, help him. Yeah, assist the delegate. Speed up negotiations by three months. Yep. Between the two of you, I know you can get us the slots. Now go! Make me any money. Alright, still good there. I know I can make it better. So I got a little bit of pink bar. It's not as much as it was before. I hope I didn't ruin anything. Not too much, at least. I used to play this uh, with my brothers, so we had like a total of three players and one computer, and it took forever to play the game because it's turn-based and you swap controllers. So it's just one person taking forever on their turn. Especially when you get just a crazy amount of cities and you're constantly checking all of them. That's right, I can't afford to open it. That's why I didn't have the... This, uh, that's why I didn't have that. Oh, I'm an asshole. Ugh. Damn it. So maybe... Ugh. Vancouver to Honolulu is going down? I thought I was making this one better. I was wrong. Okay. 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 Alright. I know I just got them, but you don't really... Ugh. Just have them back. It's fine. It's, I am going to try to get a couple more in New York. Just to become more competitive with what's this fuck? Because fuck what's this fuck? Ultimate team. Not you. I don't like you. You two, though. Blonde people. Oh, if you, they might fail if you go? Not worth it. Never mind. Apparently New York City is a bit hard to, to deal with. Okay. The Air had a successful route promotion. <sighs> That's cool. I wish I was making money. I want to make money while no one else is making money. Ideally. <laughs> yeah, they're still there. Just you wait, though. Just you wait. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Help me, instruction manual. Remember... To... Oh, what? Quick play. This explanation is a successful start to your career as a CEO of your own airline. the heck? This is like a how to play for the first three turns. I don't know if that's like enough to actually do anything. Oh, my roots okay. Good. Uh, getting worse. Good. Getting significantly worse. It's fine. Fine. Just gotta wait for that. We just gotta wait for those New York slots to open up. Because when that happens, cash money. Uh, where's Airbus? I want Airbus to show up. Give me A300s. Those are good planes. That's what I really need. I just need more, like. I need more charter planes because I have so many close by cities. So I'm using these big ass planes, which costs a lot of money. Boeing has introduced the 727 and the 737s. Oh no. I can't afford those. But these are some of the best Boeing planes. Tell me about the 727, lady. Yes. 
See, shorter range, good fuel rank, good for uh, short range transports. That's good. And the uh, 737s? Even better. A small bodied version of the 727. Find it fuel efficient even, even on commuter routes. I, f I feel like getting one of those would be extremely. could help exp my expenses on some of my short routes. Maybe. I don't even know anymore. Alright, well, we just got some more slots here. So now we can actually. Throw on. Nope, I am out of 707s. Oh no, wait, no, there we go. Yeah. Add a second plane that we can use. Double the flights. And that'll make other competitor guys suck it. Because I'm coming in. I'm coming in hot. Let me look at my other routes real fast. Mm, yeah, like the 727s. Or 737s really would be good for Vancouver, Mexico. Oh, yeah, it would. Oh, I gotta buy a plane! That's expensive! And then it's gonna be like, you're gonna make your profit. I was like, yes, yeah, because I was buying a goddamn plane! But just give me a 737. Yeah, I'll, I'll take one. You could buy one. How many do you wanna buy? One. This plane will be delivered in three months. Oh, oh, I gotta show you guys the sweet plane delivery graphics. Do you think this game didn't have enough graphics? Oh man, this plane deliveries. I'm gonna let it play out. It'll be so good. It's coming. Hope you're freaking hyped for this. Three more months pass. Fair air. Sucks. Just tell me I suck, please. It's... Someone tell me I suck. Uh, um, see, I made sixteen thousand. Just sixteen thousand. Okay. If uh, if you make negative dollars every quarter, every quarter for one year, you get a game over. Sales are increasing. All right, here we go. Check this out. Graphics. Life simulation, baby! <laughs> yeah! Told you this game is so good! You can't see that and not get excited! That's how I'm gonna do another episode. Try the other plane, see how it goes. I know the first video got 3 million views, and I. first day. And the second one never does as much as the uh, first episode of a, uh, of, a, of a series, but I. I but I know this one. It's probably, also, probably already got 1.7 million views. Uh, Kotaku was like, check this fucking shoot out, and it got me all kinds of subscribers. Please subscribe. <laughs> also, if you are, if you're still enjoying this after another episode, leave a comment down below. Let me know, please. I'll, I'd like the video. Also, let you know if you enjoy it. And then uh, I'm gonna keep going. As always, thank you guys so very much for watching. See you next time.